welcome back to another video. So today we're looking at another Ghostbusters Playmobil. Or is it Playmobil Ghostbusters? I don't know. Set. So this is another one of my son's toys. I don't have this one boxed. The ones you've seen boxed are the only ones I have. I need more. So this is probably my least favourite set out of this section. So we're going to have a look at Slimer and the Hot Dog Vendor. So here we have uh, Slimer and the Hot Dog Vendor. It's my least favourite set. I think it's mainly, it's mainly because no Ghostbusters come with it. And I'm not a big fan of Slimer. I've just realised that things come with this that also came with the Ghostbusters Firehouse. That I didn't talk about and it's these things. Little rubbery slimes that you can have sticking to things. You can have them hanging off things. They stick to the sides of walls and they stick to the figures. So you can simulate the figures being slimed. So you get three or four of these with the slime. The Slimer set, you also got a bunch with the Firehouse, and you also got a bunch with some of the other sets, not the sets we've spoke about, but I'm just going to cover them now, because we've still got packets that we've not even opened, because we've got that many of these little slime things, didn't see the point in opening them all, so some of these need cleaned, because they're kind of losing their stickiness, just need some warm soapy water to get their stickiness back, but they're just little pieces of rubber that you use, kinetic, they start to get static energy to stick to things so let's talk about this set and what we think of it so let's talk about Slimer first so let's take that out of his hand the Slimer figure itself is actually really good it is I'd say come on focus come on you know you want to focus focus who cares right. so there we go. So the Slimer figure looks, it's to scale of the Ghostbusters figures, I would say. Let me, yes, yeah, so it's about to scale. So it looks like Slimer is not too cartoony. He's not too much like the film. Yeah, so there he is. He's got a little peg hole so you could stand them on if you had a stand. But yeah, so he can hold things because he's got the same hands. So this is a burger. Comes with each layer, so you can, as I said, they're stupidly detailed. But it's got a little section here where there's no layers where you can just have a fig any figure, not just Slimer, hold a burger. So, yeah, he holds a burger, he can eat the burger, so he falls over, he doesn't stand properly. So, let's talk about this vendor set. See, first off, you get the hot dog vendor himself, he is just a regular Joe, he's not a Ghostbuster or anything like that. There we go, so he's got stubble, he's got a wee we bun it, brown, brown jumper, beige brown trousers, he's got a wee apron, the apron can come off, if I can get it off, it's a nightmare, there we go, it's just like wearing a little brown top, but when he's at work, he puts the apron on, because he's a food vendor, so I just set him on the little bike, so then he doesn't go anywhere, until I decide to do that, so we're going to do a quick jump cut, and we'll have a look at some of the detail in the hot dog set. So as it's a Playmobil set, it is ridiculously chock full of little details and little accessories. So first set of accessories here we've got is we've got a string of hot dogs. Clearly, clearly Slimer's going to want to eat those, so I'm just sitting in there. But you also get, for the vendor man, you get little hot dog tongs. Like working hot dog tongs. For picking up food from the hot dog things. We've also got a little basket full of french fries or chips as we call them here in the UK. It's going to be basket chips. You've got several hot dog buns with hot dogs in them. But the thing I liked about this is the hot dogs are actually separate. So you can get the wee vendor man to actually make your wee hot dog. And then Slimer can run away with it. And you can also see the prices of your chips, hot dogs, burgers and your juices. So there is little juices. So you've got a yeah, red juice and you've got a little yellow juice. So it's, he's also on a little bike so he can take this anywhere he wants. Inside there you get ketchup and mustard. I'm just not wanting to reach in and get them because I'll end up throwing everything about. You've got a little parasol which has still got the slime on it. So yeah, so it's a good little detailed set. It's just that I think they wanted a slimer set and they couldn't quite decide. But... In the first Ghostbusters movie, once all the ghosts escape the containment unit, Slimer does bust out of a hot dog stand with a mouthful of hot dogs. So, it gets a pass from me because at least I've stuck to some detail. So I kind of like it. It's the same price as the Stay Puff set. So that's why I think it annoys me. It should be a little bit cheaper. It should be between the Egon 
and the step off set personally. I know you get a ton of accessories with this one, but I don't think it's worth the money. But that could just be because I'm a bit biased because of the Slimer situation. But who knows? So let's do my final thoughts. Alright, so this is a good reset. If you're going to complete your Playmobil collection, you need this set. But I wouldn't recommend getting this until you've at least got one of the Ghostbuster sets. So you've got someone to bust Slimer. Because there's not much you can do with just Slimer a regular figure. You don't have any Ghostbusters to bust them. So this isn't a starter set. I'd say I said this is an add-on. Don't get this unless you've got at least one of the other sets. Personally, that's what I think. So as always, if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe if you've not already subscribed. Like the video, share it with your friends. I know I'm a few years late with doing Playmobil reviews, but... We're in lockdown and I'm struggling for content and I've just noticed something so I thought this was lost but I've just noticed it's actually there so I was looking everywhere earlier for this. It's a little basket if I can pull it out without sending everything everywhere and it's got six individual water bottles in there. So I thought this was lost when I was getting all the Ghostbusters stuff out so I couldn't find the yellow basket that went with this set but I now know where it is. Thankfully. So, as I was saying, like the video, subscribe and all that nonsense, and don't forget to have a gidgeon. <laughs>